Zach, Derek Jeter, what's it been like fishing against him all these years? Uh, it's been amazing. Uh, you know, I grew up watching him play. <laughs> Don't mean to make him feel old or anything, but like that. But uh, he's a guy you like when you think of the New York Yankees, you think Derek Jeter. And so, uh, you know, we're happy to see him go, obviously being an opponent, but uh, he's been great for the game. Um, you know, he's a great guy. Everyone speaks highly of him. Uh, but to not see him manning shortstop uh, next year is going to be it's going to be interesting. You know, like I said, uh, I think a lot of people when they think baseball, you think Derek Jeter. So um, we're happy that you know he's had a great career and and uh, looking forward to his retirement. And we, we wish him well in his retirement. And for you being in the AL East, what's that been like? I mean, just being able to play against him and have the opportunity to play against somebody who's going to go down as one of the best in baseball. It's been a privilege. I mean, anytime you've had the opportunity to face a, a you know a Hall of Famer that caliber of a player on the field and then a caliber of person he is off the, the field uh, it's been awesome you know the interactions we've had I mean I've never played with him but he's always been uh, you know when I first came up as a young guy in 2011 he was maybe one of the first guys that said something to me about congratulations or hey you got good stuff and stuff like that and I mean that just sticks with you when you're a young player and a, a guy of his caliber comes up to you because you're you're kind of nervous you don't want to approach him uh, but he's been a great guy